Democrats don't want Biden to be president again. A majority of Democrats now think one term is plenty for President Joe Biden, despite his insistence that he plans to seek re-election in 2024. That's according to a new poll from the Associated Press NORC Center for Public Affairs Research that shows 37% of Democrats say they want him to seek a second term, down from 52% in the weeks before last year's midterm elections. While Biden has trumpeted his legislative victories and ability to govern, the poll suggests relatively few U.S. adults give him high marks on either. Follow-up interviews with poll respondents suggest that many believe the 80-year-old's age is a liability, with people focused on his coughing, his gait, his gaffes, and the possibility that the world's most stressful job would be better suited for someone younger. Biden has previously leaned heavily on his track record to say that he's more than up to the task. When asked if he can handle the office's responsibilities at his age, the president has often responded as if he's accepting a dare, Watch me. Democratic candidates performed better than expected in the 2022 midterm elections, a testament to Biden's message that he is defending democracy and elevating the middle class. Democrats expanded their control of the Senate by one seat and narrowly lost their House majority, even though history indicated there would be a Republican wave. Overall, 41% approve of how Biden is handling his job as president, the poll shows, similar to ratings at the end of last year. A majority of Democrats still approve of of the job Biden is doing as president, yet their appetite for a re-election campaign has slipped despite his electoral track record. Only 22% of U.S. adults overall say he should run again, down from 29%, who said so before last year's midterm elections. The decline among Democrats saying Biden should run again for president appears concentrated among younger people. Among Democrats age 45 and over, 49% say Biden should run for re-election, nearly as many as the 58% who said that in October. But among those under 45, 23% now say he should run for re-election, after 45% said that before the midterms. Already the oldest president in U.S. history, Biden has been dogged by questions about his age as he would be 86 if he serves a full eight years as president. He often works long days, standing for hours, remembering the names of strangers he meets while traveling who want to share a story about their lives with him. Republican voters are unwilling to give Biden the benefit of the doubt, hurting his ratings.